<laughs> you okay over there? I'm I'm telling you this slaps right now. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> uh, hey. Tell them what we're doing today, Charlie. Arby's came out with what they're calling the spiciest sandwich ever made. It's a uh, chicken sandwich from Arby's. Here, take the dip. Oh, they're hip. They're getting us on TikTok. Oh, the oh, Diablo wow. Dare Challenge. Ooh, take the Diablo Dare Challenge, baby. Can we post this on Huge Charles? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> We, got we have to have trendy music though. Yeah. Like the, oh no, oh no, 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 no. I think you're you're behind the trends. Is that not the trend anymore? I don't think that's the trend anymore. Well, probably, you can play. Yeah. You can play Clay Aiken. Oh, <laughs> I wish I was invisible. Thanks Opera GX for sponsoring the video. Like I said, I've recently switched from Google Chrome to Opera GX because Google Chrome just literally blows up my computer, tanks its performance because it's an outrageous resource hog. And Opera GX is significantly better in that regard. It's not going to take any toll on your computer. And just in case you have a lot of tabs open, Opera GX even has a feature called Hot Tabs Killer, which will literally just close the ones that might be slowing down your performance. So it is always just going to be like the optimal experience and never slowing you down. It has tons of great features. Customization, of course, is key with Opera GX. You can customize it like fully to whatever you want, including like custom animated wallpapers. So there's a lot of options there too to keep everything looking stylish exactly how you like. There's also really great features like the force dark mode. It also has its own extension store so you can have very important extensions that you use every single day. It's just an absolute multitude of great features at Opera GX. Things like even just being able to use Facebook Messenger or Instagram Messenger on the sidebar while you're browsing. So if you're interested in trying Opera GX, make sure to click the link in the description below to download it. I'd highly recommend it, so definitely check it out. Download Opera GX in the link below. I just got like a little shock. I did too. I'm not kidding. I thought I was going crazy. I was gonna say it shocked me the first time yeah, I took a sip. what the fuck is that? Why is there whipped cream electros fucking statically charged? All right. All right, we ready? I'm gonna calm the fuck down. Matt, you and I put Arby's at an F tier on our tier list of fast food. You remember yes. that? Yes, and I'm I pretty, pretty positive accurate. it's deserved. Yeah. <laughs> Their right, slogan let me see. is, let me get, we have the show meats. Me, show me, let me get close uh, up. I'm getting a little lettuce off. So what is oh the sauce God. on this? I, it says it's ghost pepper cheese. But even the patty looks spicy. Yeah. I mean the bun, sorry. There's jalapenos on it. Here, I'm gonna take a little nibble of the bun. Just projectile vomits. The RV's classic. Oh, there's absolutely spice in the bun. That's so weird. When somebody's slogan is we have the meats and they don't clarify what kind of meats, you already know it's not going to be great. I actually think this is going to taste pretty decent. I mean, that looks like a frozen stadium chicken yeah. patty. Smell it though. I'm getting a hint like a barbecue, right? Yeah, there's yeah. some barbecue in there. There's mayonnaise. Lettuce. Way too much. Oh, then I'm safe. Yeah, we'll be, it will be good. All right, let's... All right. Should we be COVID safe and not yeah, cheers? Yeah, don't cheers. Just right. hey. That's pretty tasty. I don't like the bun, but I like the No, chicken. I don't like the bun, but the chicken's nice. The bun's a little dry. Is it hot at all for any of you? Not yet. Is that relish? What is that, sh that shit in the middle? Chicken. <laughs> no, that's cut up jalapenos. Oh, okay. Is it not hot? Not at all. Can I take another bite, maybe? <laughs> you know what we're missing? Maybe it builds. Hold on. That's what I, what I was thinking, but it hasn't started yet. Here, wait, make sure you get, see like the jalapeno in there, really make sure you take a bite of that. I, mean, I would expect with this hottest sandwich ever made, every bite would be painful. Does it at least taste good? This is the best thing I've ever had at Arby's. And so I mean, maybe. It's not saying, but I mean, it's <laughs> fine. I mean, the fries are definitely better. There's no spice. bad girl. I would say, wait, not pepper jelly. I don't think it was that color when you brought it. It's fine. Wait, no, this is, that, that is absolutely a different, yeah, that's fine. It's Caitlin doing it, not me. That smells like it's gonna be fucking painful. Oh my God. It's not gonna be that bad. Guys, I think I actually made the sandwich better. I'm not gonna lie to you. I don't want that. You can try it if you want. <laughs> it, I'm, I'm telling you this slaps right now. Well, I love pepper jelly. Is that raw? Wait, let me see. Wait, wait, that's absolutely raw, right? I just took yeah, a, show Caleb. I can't kidding. tell if it's just like the sauce or if it's just actually like pink in there. That, I mean, it's pink, but that's definitely pink. Yeah, you might want to. Okay, well now I'm kind of concerned. Is yours that color? No. 
No, well, mine is uh, cooked all the way through. This is when the comments will be like, well, actually, based on the current location of the sun in the equator, that's actually how chicken's supposed to look on a Tuesday. It could have been, could have been a fatty piece too. Yeah, but the only be. thing I would say to appease your mind is that these are definitely not cooked when you order them. They're cooked yeah. frozen and then cooked right. again. So, so. That's probably a weird, like fatty piece that yeah. has, you know, like when you get a chicken, it sometimes has those red spots in it. It's probably that. I wouldn't eat it, but that's one of the various meats they talk about. Right. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm not gonna lie. Arby's is trash. It is like this is. That was the best thing I've ever had from Arby's, and it might actually just be salmonella. So. <laughs> Oh god, I've got that running through mine too. It might just be fat. Is it just fat? Yeah, it's just like not cooked enough fat. How about eating the fries? Am I allowed to eat the fries? The only good part Why of the meal? Why is he running? I don't know. What's wrong with him? Please throw up. Please throw up. I'm not gonna throw up. I don't feel like sick, I'm just... What were you sprinting about? Oh, there was no paper towels. <laughs> no, knowing how we are... I know that the next step of this video is Charlie now wants to eat something spicy. Well, we have to now. Yep, told you. It is crazy how Arby's and Burger King are so alike in the way that they cannot get anything right. I will say Burger King even had more heat than this. It yeah, did. it did. Like this, if you handed me this and said this is a spicy chicken sandwich, I would even question that it's a normal spicy chicken sandwich. Chick-fil-A's spicy sandwich has more kick than this. Let alone the hottest sandwich in the world. Yeah, that was trash. Keep oh my going. God, yeah, what, 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 what are we doing here? Oh, this is, the end. this is the end hot sauce. Somewhere between 90 million and 100 million Scoville. Realistically, Ooh. I think it was three to six. I don't remember what it was. Yeah, it doesn't say. We might as well do Bernoriums. No, no I was going get carried away. <laughs> <laughs> right, well, isn't the whole point that we're spicing up the Arby sandwich? I'm still worried mine could be like an actual salmonella hazard. You can use my sandwich if you want, though. <laughs> Oh, it's not. That's, that's a that's baby hot. bag bitch dip. There yeah. we go. All right. Ready? Yeah. Cheers. The end. I thought you said BN like you were speaking French. Why? Why would you do that? Fuck, man. God damn it. Wow. Wow. Oh, my God. No, dude. Oh, my God. I forgot. I actually forgot. Nostril, like any sinus issues, should just eat spicy oh. shit because that shit clears it really quickly. Yeah, Caleb just cleared his COVID problems. Yeah, he can taste I can again. Smell again. Yeah, <laughs> Arby's really came in hot, am I right, boys? Yeah, <clears throat> the, Arby, the Arby's fries are hot in the Diablo Dare challenge. Feels good to be back. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome back from Christmas break, boys. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm sorry, I panic a little bit. Okay, that's fine. My teeth burn. Oh, 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 my God, okay, this one's bad. Wow. All right, we're back. We're back. Ew. <laughs> uh, it's 2022, baby. It's going to be a huge year. Oh. Start out with the end. My teeth burn. <laughs> oh, there's a lot of mucus going down my throat. <laughs> oh. It's flushing oh out God. the salmonella. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, yeah, I'm melting it away. <laughs> you okay over there? You want some Arby's to fix it? <laughs> what is that? <laughs> <laughs> what is that helping? It's and where so is it long. coming out of? What do you think goes on at Arby's HQ to make them so mad? Nothing. I actually believe they hired a 16-year-old from TikTok and told them to run their marketing department. That sandwich was the best thing I've ever had from Arby's. Shoes. I love that the best thing you've had from Arby's, you couldn't take more than two bites because it was raw. <laughs> That's the secret. That's when they're at their best. What if we just don't cook it? <laughs> we have a problem with drive through times. They're too long. How can we fix this? No grills. <laughs> <laughs> you should have tried the sandwich, Danny. You might have actually liked it. That's yeah. good. I love me some Arby's. <laughs> <laughs> I... I think I'm, it's been 20 years since the last time I had it, and I think I'm gonna go another 20. I may go for 30 this time. It actually went downhill in the last 20 years. Absolutely. Ah, They're jingle slaps though. What blows me away is that there's people that eat it regularly and defend it. Yeah, absolutely. And it's literally just deli meats with melted well, cheese. Well, literally look at this chicken patty. There, places try to hide that things are like frozen and 
you know, thrown into a deep fryer. That is literally just a frozen chicken patty pulled out of a bag. That's what I like. And the best part is that's literally just like a, like a breast like that's been pounded to death yeah. and tenderized and then covered in that. That was good. Oh, good. You want to shout some people out on your channel? Yeah, shout um, outs to Clay Aiken. <laughs> um, the Arby's for having the, Arby's. the meats. We love yep. Arby's. Thanks, All right, Arby's. shout out Clay Aiken. See you later. Thanks, Arby's. Arby's.